enforcement directorate has now moved the Delhi High Court asking for Satyendra Jain of the Delhi government to be moved out of LNJP hospital. The enforcement directorate in its plea has said that the LNJP hospital is directly under the control of the Delhi government to which Satyendra Jain belongs and that there is a likelihood that the medical report of senior Ahmadmi Party leader and Delhi Minister Satyendra Jain could be fudged or biased because the hospital into which he's been admitted is run by the Delhi government. The Enforcement Directorate also states that Satyendra Jain is extremely influential and that medical examination should be conducted by doctors from AIMS, from the Ram Manohar Lohia Hospital or the Saptarjung Hospital, which are not under the Delhi government. Remember, Satyendra Jain is the health minister of Delhi. Well, all of this comes after the Enforcement Directorate alleged that Trinamool Neta and Bengal Minister Partho Chatterjee was faking illness to evade questioning all his reports after examination at AIMS, not in Bengal, but in Bhubaneswar in Odisha, came out to be normal. So this is very interesting. The Enforcement Directorate basically saying, we don't trust the medical reports that might come out on Satendra Jain, Delhi Minister, because he is currently admitted in a hospital that is run by the Delhi government. Munish Pandey with me on the phone line for this uh, news break. Uh, Munish, uh, Enforcement Directorate showing no faith in the LNJP hospital where Satendra Jain is currently lodged. Uh, what are they expecting to see happen? Well, Shiv, as far as Satendra Jain is concerned, remember when he was arrested by the Enforcement Directorate, later on he was granted uh, to judicial custody by a Delhi court. Now, since the time he was sent to the judicial custody, uh, he has been admitted to the LNJP hospital and uh, what the reports which has been received by the enforcement director, there are certain parameters of Satyendra Jain which are not stable and that is why he needs to stay in that particular hospital. Now what ED is alleging at this point of time is that it appears and uh, there is a chance that uh, Satyendra Jain may influence the hospital because it's a, a state government run hospital and that is why there should be a test conducted by uh, hospital which is run by the central government like him. Now, uh, the application has been filed uh, by the enforcement directorate. The court is yet to pass an order, but it appears that after Partha Chatterjee's case, in which what we saw that, uh, you know, in the uh, uh, in the hospital where he was initially admitted in Kolkata, when Partha Chatterjee was admitted, then ED alleged before the court that uh, they were not able to interrogate Partha Chatterjee. The medical reports were... Uh, allegedly searched and also Partha Chatterjee inside the hospital was behaving like a dawn because he was uh, influencing the hospital staff. Now after that there was a medical test conducted in Ames Bhuvneshwar on the order of court and uh, in that uh, medical report it was uh, clear that there are parameters of uh, Partha Chatterjee which are stable and he is a fit case to be taken into custodial interrogation and later on he was granted to Police custody. Now, in Satyendra Jain case also, what ED is alleging at this point of time and what they are suspecting that there may be a chance that the reports are fudged by the uh, staff of uh, LNJP hospital because uh, it's a state-run hospital. Maybe there is an influence of uh, state government on that hospital and that is why there should be an independent test conducted by a hospital like in Delhi.